How's it going out there? Welcome from H2 Tech Video. Today I want to show you how to set up your Chromecast. This is going to be part two. This is going to be how to set it up from a Kindle Fire. So this will work on the Kindle Fire, Kindle Fire HD, or Kindle Fire HDX. Now, um, this again is the part two. So that there's a there's actually two videos you need to watch before you watch this one. The first one is you need to watch part one of how to set up your Chromecast, and it just shows you how to plug it in and make sure you're on this same screen on your TV. The second one is you're gonna have to watch how to download one mobile market on the Kindle Fire or Kindle Fire HDX. I will have those uh, links in the description so you can go back and check those out first because the way we're gonna do this, you have to download this special app first in order to be able to set this up. So if you don't have one mobile market installed on your kindle fire this will not work so i'm just kind of prefacing that first so if you need to go back and watch those first do that and if you already have one mobile market you can just get started right from here all right so i'm going to move down to our kindle fire here and first thing we want to do is we want to go to silk or silk browser we can come up here where it says web we basically want to go to the internet and we're going to tap here and we type in chrome chromecast.com slash setup that's also right on the TV in case you didn't see it so now it's going to say welcome let's get you set up and casting you're going to tap get it on Google Play tap there excuse me oh sorry let's go back one more time okay so when you tap it this is what should come up if it doesn't come up just press the back arrow <clears throat> excuse me you're gonna press the back arrow come back here again and tap get it on Google Play this option will come up you're gonna tap one mobile market tap just once and it will take you to the Chromecast app in the one mobile market you're gonna tap download and then it'll say start downloading right here. You're gonna, um, sorry, sometimes it, it takes a while to download. This one downloaded really fast. So after it downloads, it will ask you, hey, do you want to install the Chromecast app? We're gonna tap next, install, and it will begin to install. Then we're gonna tap open. Okay, it's gonna ask you to accept the terms and conditions. Tap accept. And then now it will begin to look for the Chromecast. And there it is. Let's set up Chromecast 9332. And what you want to do is take a quick look at your TV and make sure you see the same number. So Chrome, it says my setup name is Chromecast 9332. And from here, we're going to tap Setup. Oh, screen flipped. Okay. So now it's connecting to it. So give it a second, let it connect. And then on the TV, you're gonna see, it's gonna change. Now it says awaiting instructions, it's gonna have a number, J7B6. Make sure you see the same number on your screen, J7B6. Tap, I see the code. Here's where we name what we want our Chromecast to be called, okay? So, you can name it some kind of fun name if you're only gonna have one Chromecast in the house. So you could name it My Chromecast or or cool buddy, whatever you want to call it. If you have multiple ones in the house, I recommend that you name it by what room it's in. So you may want to say bedroom Chromecast. And then tap set name. And now it'll ask you to um, select what Wi-Fi network you want it to be on. So mine is Miss Rudolph, but you can tap here if you need to change it to a different network. So tap that, and it's going to ask you to put in the password. I'm going to put that in real quick. Once we're done, we're going to tap done. And then we're going to tap set network. I don't know why I keep flipping the screen, but whatever. And now it's doing the, the final setup. And the TV It's going to say connecting to that network, the one that you selected. Okay, and that's it. It says, sweet, you are ready to cast. Okay, and as you can see on your TV, Chromecast is fully set up and ready to go. 
And that's it. So now yours is going to look a little bit different because if you're setting it up for the first time, you actually will see a little circle spinning because it's going to do an initial software update when you first set it up. So it's going to download the software, then it's going to reset itself, then it's going to install the update, and then it's going to um, turn off, turn back on again, and then it will be on the screen and it will be ready to go. Alright, so this has been how to set up your Chromecast from a Kindle Fire. Again, Kindle Fire HD or HDX. Hope you guys found this helpful. Make sure you like, favorite, and share the video. As well as follow us on Facebook, facebook.com slash videos. Take care and have a good one.